Hello, hello, hello! Welcome back to Pokemon Y! Last episode, we finally made it through that little mirroring cave area. And now, we're in Shalor City, I believe. Chester is about to evolve. Saya is getting up there in the levels. S and Tyrant are catching up. And Chu is also about to evolve. And hopefully soon, we will get our Mega Evolutions and we can get them hashtag arm cannons. And we will get on with this game. Alright, this is hopefully going to be a bit of a shorter episode simply because I don't have the hard drive space to record that much... <laughs> that much gameplay. Know how your hair sticks up all over the place when you wake up? Think Mega Evolution is like that? <laughs> Mega Evolution is Super Saiyan! Yes indeed, yes it is. Alright, we are going to heal up because our Pokemon are a little beat up at the moment. I've lost my stylus, there it is, okay. Hello and welcome, yes please rest, no, 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 what, why would you say no to that? Yes, rest. Bloop, 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 bloop. Thank you for waiting, we've restored your Pokemans to full health. They are very rare, but in the Kalos region you can find mysterious stones that are filled with life energy. A shining stone that emitted great warmth was discovered. And then a great tower was built to house and protect the stone. Hey you, in the corner. Hey, how's it going friend? I'm Mr. Bonding. No, no, I do not need an explanation. We do need to use them though. <clears throat> we have received an O power from Mr. Bonding. Critical power level 1. Increases critical hit ratio. Alright. And he is mysteriously gone. Let's actually take a look at that in a minute. I've been playing this totally sweet game recently. You play as some cool little dude who runs around and whacks enemies to the beat of the music. Is that like that one game with Jack Black in it? <laughs> Alright. What do we got here? We have we do have an O power option, correct? Yes, O powers. Capturing power. Use. Use capturing power level one. Okay. I, I, I don't know how this works. Prize money power. Use. Use prize money power, level one. Okay. Okay, so we have a certain amount of these little points that we can use. An attack power. Can't use that. Can't use that. Can't use that. We can use HP power. Use HP restoring power, level one. Okay. So, go back. O power. It didn't show the HP power. That sucks, it's not even showing the HP power. Okay. So for a couple minutes we have prize money power and capture power. So we can capture more Pokemon? Is that what it's saying? Do you have balls? I need balls. Do you have balls? 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 Those are not balls. Well, you have TMs with you too, that's crazy. You have balls. Great balls of fire. Great balls. No hyper balls. Ultra balls. Yeah, give me those. Okay. Okay, we need balls. Balls, balls, balls. We're gonna go catch. We're gonna try to go catch. Obviously, prize money power and capture power are for opposite effects, but we're gonna see how it works. See if it helps us. Real quick here. Alright, we're in the cave. We're in the cave. We're in the cave. Hey, hey, hey. We're in the cave. Let's catch us a Pokemon. Let's hope it's something we didn't already catch. Or it can be that thing, which I do believe I caught one of. Yes, I have, but that's okay. We can wonder trade it. We can wonder trade it. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, what the hell? Someone just offered me accuracy power. What the fuck was that? Holy shit. This game is getting crazy. This is like... This, this is how you make a Pokemon slowly into multiplayer, is you give each other buffs and shit. And then you suddenly have... Like a team built together. That's gonna be interesting. Okay. Aerial Ace! Nope, Chuck Tus. Oh, I forgot about this Pokemon. God damn it, Shadow Sneak. I forgot this was a bitch to fight. Yep. Of course, I picked the wrong freaking Pokemon to fight here. Slash! Ha! 
Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. We got this. Go back to Chester. <laughs> Come on, Chester. We can do it! Delve Rock. Damn it. That's fine. That's fine. If you want to offer O powers to me, we can maybe set that up. I don't want to give out... I don't want to necessarily give out my friend code to everybody, but... I'm guessing if I don't add the person back, then it won't be as big of a deal. As far as how it impacts me. And that fucking killed it. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> Whatever. Blaziken level 39. Jesus fuck. Oh, and the effects wore off. Okay, never mind. We sort of see how it works now, though. Prize money... They don't last very long. Alright, let's actually... Oh, power again. Okay, so we need to wait for time to build up those points back, and then we can use the power again. And then as we use them, they should level up, I believe is how, the, how this works. So, we shall see. Yes, rest my Pokemon, please. <coughs> and then we'll see if the Mart people have any revives, since I wasted all mine in the cave. Got any revives, bro? You have regular revives. I guess that'll work. They are expensive as hell, too. That's fine. Yep. Alrighty then, then. What did you have? I wasn't even paying attention. I just know it wasn't balls. Oh! TMs. They're all TMs. They are expensive TMs. Okay, we will wait for those. Until we are showered with money in this game. As I'm told, happens. But I have not seen it happen on myself. Alright, what is this way? Who are you? So, I know this hiker who really likes ferris wheels. Looks like he finally found love. Okay. Oh, hello. There exists an item that can change a Pokemon's ability. Well, that's what I heard, but where do I actually find one? I don't know. Hi, you. I was invited out the other day by a friend who recently joined up with Team Flare. He kept going on about how only Team Flare had a future to look forward to. Lovely. Oh, what's that you have there? That's a Kalos Pokedex, isn't it? Let me look for a moment. In Co Coastal Kalos, you've seen 57 Pokemon. That's no mean feat there, child. Take this in honor of your effort. Eviolite? Wait. Oh. Okay. It raises the what and the what of the what? <laughs> Hang on. What? It raises both defense and special defense. So I can give that to Saya. What does Saya have? Amulet coin. Yep. And let's give the amulet... No, not the revive. No, oh, where'd amulet coin go? Oh. Give that to S. Alright, that should work. Since my starters that aren't evolved will be evolved soon, it's probably the better idea than giving it to like Chester or something. Evio light. Interesting. Okay. Hello, hiker. I'm really sorry, but I'm looking for something. I'm really sorry. Oh, Jesus. Fuck you. At least you're not trying to sell me whatever those things are. Alright, that goes somewhere else. And we will probably need to do super training soon as well. Alor City, a city of awakening. Awakening, they say. Traditionally, Pokemon battles were a ritual that people in Pokemon used to learn about and accept one another. Interesting concept there. Hello. If you are a trainer, will you show me how you're raising your Pokemon with loving care? Sure. Which Pokemon will you show me? Okay. Let's try Chester, see if it likes me. <laughs> You've raised it quite well. Token of Gratitude. Footprint Ribbon. Okay. Interesting. Alrighty, we got a ribbon. As you imitate someone, you'll create your own style. If you want to be strong, it might be a good idea to imitate a strong trainer. That is true. Hi! Do you have any flying or psychic type Pokemon with you? That's too bad. Do you just want to trade? I can maybe make that happen. Let's check out this house first. 
I'm sure I have something I can trade her or give her. Oh? Oh my! Your Quillidin seems to like you. That's so nice to see. Take this. Wow, everybody's just handing me shit. Because I have a starter. Okay. Even if Pokemon are the same species, they have different nature and so on. Okay. Who are you? There's always the... There's always the Hollercaster when you want to check the news. Being good or bad at Pokemon battles is just one of many measures of people. I want to show off my awesomeness in eating contests. Okay, kid. Sure you do. Alrighty, let's see if we have a flying or psychic type Pokemon to give her. Just to see what happens. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Right, let's deposit. We'll store War Turtle temporarily in box three. And try to find a flying or psychic type. We have that Farfetch we received in a train. <laughs> I don't know that it'd be right to give that right back out, but you know, we do have that. Battle box! I forgot about that. Alright, what about psychic type? I know we have a psychic type somewhere. What is that? That is Flabba Bay. That is... Let's go over one. What about... What about Mr. Mime? I can always catch another Mr. Mime, because there was a million of them. Let's actually... Yeah, Mime Jr. We'll trade it Mime Jr. because we can also catch more of those. And since it just evolves right into Mr. Mime, it's not all that useful, I guess. See what she wants to trade for. Alrighty, hi. Yes, I do. Oh my god, really? You lazy! There's other people in the room? Okay, we got Stardusts. Interesting. Is that just the item to sell? That really? A yep. We got five of them though. Jesus. We probably just got paid well. Let's find out how much we got paid and then we'll move on out of this damn city. Doesn't seem to be a whole lot of here, but we have got quite a bit of good a decent amount of items here. Alright, deposit. Mime Jr. Withdraw. War turtle. We need you back so you can get your arm cannons. No. Right. Now you sell. Yep, you know it. There are a thousand each, so we just made five thousand bucks. Sweet. Made up for some of the items we bought. All right, do do do. What else does the city have to offer us? Oh! Hi guys. Hey Epos, how's your journey going? Hello Adam. Let's compare our Kalo, Co Coastal Kalos Pokedexes and see who has more kinds of Pokemon. Uh, you already said to put it another way like that. You know, this brings up a Tumblr post I saw about actually the rival. But just that... All these trainers have separate dream. Like, you you don't even list a dream about your Pokemon journey, but you have Serena, who's trying to become the Pokemon champion, Trevor, who's trying to catch as many Pokemon as possible, and you're just crushing all of their dreams. You catch more Pokemon, you beat Serena, you probably dance better than Tierra. Like, that's really depressing. Oh, so you've seen Kangaskhan too. Okay. To say hello to the Mega Evolution Guru. That's right, he did say that. Let's do it. Were we supposed to say hello again? A person called the Mega Evolution Guru. What? That was... Okay, that was weird dialogue. The Tower of Mastery. We're going to the Tower of Mastery. Yes, yes, I know. Thank you. Who are you, Psychic Bro? When you act like Pokemon exist only to battle, winning or losing becomes the only thing that matters. That can make everything a lot less fun. Oh crap, I missed the pop-up. Shout out. When something fun happens or you're in a, you're feeling good, let everybody know with a shout out. Yeah. We'll let, uh, uh, I used Opow. No, wait, what? Shout out. Yeah. Shout. E. 
Shout out to E Pass Vax. Since he demanded on my asks.fm that I give E Pass Vax a shout out. There you go. I want to see every single move that can be used by Pokemon. Yeah, yeah. Crazy hair. Alrighty. Wait, are you done? Wait, he moved. Now I'm really confused. What the hell? I don't understand this place. This place is huge! Hi. Let's trade our citrus berries for one of your lepa berries, sure. We got a lepa berry. I wish I had the Pokemon move fly. Friendship is power! Sure. Okay. <laughs> if you say so, I will agree with you. Hmm, a team like you and Killidan can accomplish anything. Thank you. Hi. Alita Karina is in the Tower of Mastery. Alright, game. I know to go to the Tower of Mastery. I get it. I get it. Right? You're, you guys are gonna slow me down, though. Epos, check this out. A new dance? Isn't this stone cool? I got this from this. I got it from this person called the Wandering Stone Collector for showing off my dance moves. It might be a mega stone. You can have it. I want you to have it because you're such a great trainer and all. I still remember our battle on Route 5. <laughs> okay. Wow. Holy crap. 3D camera angles! That's the Tower of Mastery. Alright. I'll go call Treads then. Go on ahead, okay? Let's do it! Yeah, yeah. Oh god, there's cameras. Hi. I want to be more awesome than I am now. I know trainers and Pokemon feel that way. Okay. There's a Pokeball. I see the Pokeball. You can't trick me, game. I see it. Max Other. Damn it. You tricked me. Well played. Well played. Well played. Is there another one? Is there another one? No, there's not. Let's go in here. There's one over here. One over there. Into the Tower of Mastery we go! Holy shit. Who was that? Mega Lucario? Awesome! Well, that's why Leader Karina's trained up in here, because she wants herself a Mega Lucario. Knock knock! Oh, I can actually go in here. Shit. Okay. Hi, Brink! Oh? You must be Adam then. Sycamore told me you were coming. I'm called the Mega Evolution Guru, I guess. You could say that I'm acquaintance of his, but Mega Evolution isn't my real name, of course. Come here for a moment, will you? I'll show you my name. Hmm, only one of you? I thought he gave five kids a Pokedex. Isn't there anyone else with you? Oh? Who's that you talking to, Epos? Epo, call me the Mega Evolution Guru. Guru? <laughs> guru. 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 Oh, uh, my name's Tierno. That's Adam over there. My name's Trevor. Pleased to meet you, Sycamore peoples. Still only three of you. Link. What is this now? Were you the one who found that intriguing stone? Yes, it was me. Yup, sure was. Nothing good comes from lying. Were you really the one that- What? Really? Really? What the hell? Nothing good comes from lying, kids. Oh, oh. What? Wow, okay. Oh, jeez. Does that mean everyone's arrived? Hey there, you made it to Shadler City. Lucario is in its Pokeball, but it's really happy to see you. We should go see what's going on, too. I bet it's Team Flare! Oh, nope, it's not. <laughs> I lied. Looks like everyone is finally here. Epos! Oh, God. Where have you been? We've been here. It feels like it's been some time since our whole group gathered in one place. Yeah, I think it's been since we met up on Route 7. Mr. Mega Evolution Guru, I've been wondering this whole time, who is that over there? This is my granddaughter, Corina. She's Sal Shallower City's gym leader. So, Sycamore peoples, now that you're all here, I should explain Mega Evolution to you. 
I assume that you all know about Pokemon evolution. I know, I know. Um, you have your Pokemon battle a lot, and they grow stronger and evolve. Oh, and there are Pokemon that evolve with certain items. Music. Some Pokemon, all right. Hmm. Some Pokemon evolve through, fr okay, I can't. Yes, exactly, oh. Yes, exactly, and that's what Pokemon, blah, 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 blah. Indeed, Mega Evolution is a transformation of Pokemon that were thought to be unable to evolve any further. It's a whole new level of power, over 9,000. So, and in an evolutionary line, like Charmander, Trimillion, and Charizard, does that mean Charizard would evolve even further? Yes, exactly right. But not all Pokemon have a Mega Evolution. There's a reason I used the word transformation a moment ago. Mega Evolution differs from evolution because it ends after a certain amount of time. In other words, it's a temporary evolution. What? It goes back, it evolves, but then it goes back to what it was before? Yes, Mega Evolution is a special kind of evolution. That said, we still know very little about it. What we know is that it requires special items. And the most important element is a trust between Pokemon and Trainer. Trust, in other words, the bond between Trainer and Pokemon. She just said that. To make Mega Evolution work, you need two items, a Mega Stone for the Pokemon and a Meta, oh, I didn't know about that. A Mega Ring, which has a mysterious stone set in it for the trainer. Since Professor Sycamore entrusted each of you with a Pokedex, I would like to give these items to all of you. I'd like to share them with you, but... But? But what? Just come out and say it already. I'm sorry, but presently I only have one Mega Ring. It's a very precious item. That's why my research isn't getting anywhere. So I want you all to decide among yourselves who will be the one who challenges the Mega Evolution successor. I'll pass. Pokemon battling isn't really my scene. So Mega Evolution would be way out of my league. Me too. It would be a real cool memory and it does look interesting, but I want to complete the Pokedex first. If you do try to accomplish too much at once, it won't do anything. So that leaves Epos and Serena then. Raiders don't get much better than you two. Adam, let's battle for it. Alrighty. Let's do it. Let's do it. I challenge you to Pokemon's battles. Oh, wrong one. You, Serena. Okay. Rival battle. Are you ready? Of course I'm ready. Yeah, yeah. And see? See, that, that makes it even worse. Because she's all like really passionate and hardcore about her dreams. And I'm just like, okay, I'll do it. And then I'm going to kick her butt. And she's gonna be really sad, and it's just gonna all be really, really sad. What do? Yeah, yeah, trainer, challenge by Trainer Serena, come at me. He starts out with... Holy crap, that's pretty cool. Meowstic, female version. All right, Seed Bomb. Light screen, oh snap. Starts out with a defensive move. I start out with an attack. Boom, 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 boom. Next, I will use cut and cut its head off. Psybeam, oh no. Now that was a cool Psybeam animation. Coming from like above its head, using its arms. It avoided the attack, seriously? Seriously, where's my, I need another accuracy buff here. <laughs> Jesus, that attack is brutal. Oh my God. Need alarm! Disarming voice? What the fuck? The hell is that? That was weird. You're dead. Sorry, Meowistic. Can't have none of that today. About to send in Abzol. Uh, switch Pokemon. You send in Abzol, I'll send in Tyrant! Go, Tyrant, go! Abzol. Abzol's so cool. Alright. Use Rock Tomb! Flash. Not very effective. Ah, ah, ah! Critical hit, though, unfortunately. Yeah, you were hurt by my Rocky Helmet! What you know about my Rocky Helmet? Damn, that did a lot of damage. And it speed fell. That was pretty cool. Alright, let's use Strength to finish it off. You're dead, Absol! Look at that, I'm just kicking her butt. 
I run gained all that XP. S screw to level 32. About to send in Braxian. I will send in my War Tortle. Wait, did she not get a Anto starter? What? <sighs> Why does she not have like a charge? What? Okay. You too good for that, Serena? Aqua Tail. Bye bye, Braxian. <laughs> Oh, uh, poor Serena. Almost level 36. Psygru to level 34. What up? Tyrant level 33, like a boss. Oh, she looks, she looks so sad. I feel so bad for this. So, I lost them. I'm just like, yeah, I kicked your booty, girl. What you know about me? And, okay. Thank you. There may be winners and losers in a Pokemon battle, but blah blah blah. Okay. Well then, Atom. First, you should challenge Corina, the gym leader. Pokemon need a Mega Stone, and trainers need Mega Ring. Okay. You'll be waiting for me at the gym, and then I can go get a Mega Stone. Alrighty. She she just walked out. She's like, "Fuck you guys." He's just like, he beat me, he crushed my dreams, fuck you guys, I'm out of here. I'm getting my own mega ring, bitch. Oh. Tierno, how we work to be the best trainers we can be too? Alright then, let's aim for the top. Hope to see you again soon, Epo. See ya, Shawnee. Why is Shauna still here? You don't really need to go to the trouble of comparing. Every living creature is unique. But still, having someone compete to compete against and aim for greater heights with is a very fine thing. Except when they drop the mic and walk out after I beat them. Alright. You're way too happy about this, Serena. Or Shauna. Why did it just fade out like that? What was the point of that? Did I fall asleep? Alright. So Karina wants me to challenge her, which we will do in the next episode. Holy shit, that's a trainer. Yes, we will do that in the next episode of Pokemon Y. We will challenge Karina, the gym leader, and unlock the secrets of Mega Evolution. Yes, indeed. And look at that streaming level. There's no transition or anything. It just moves the camera angle a bit, and you are good to go. All right, as always, guys, thank you so very much for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode. What do you say we get some Mega Blaziken arm cannons and whatever else Mega Evolution forms we can get? Bye bye.